today I've got a pretty exciting palette I'm pumped up for. I'm looking forward to recording this bad boy, going through these boxes. But I've got nine very large, heavy boxes that came on one wooden palette. So today, Amazon liquidation, total price point. The MSRP of everything on Amazon.com is $3,322 pretty good price point correct but here's the kicker my actual cost what I paid since I buy locally I pick up a person I don't pay any kind of shipping cost all I have to pay is the price taxes and then like a, a, a buyer's premium of like 10% my total cost two hundred fifty two dollars and fourteen cents and I did the math before I started this video because I was curious all I paid for this was seven point five percent of the actual MSRP of all these items. So it's gonna be pretty much impossible to lose money on this whenever you get this for seven and a half percent. That's crazy cheap. So I'm excited. What these should be is a hodgepodge, from what I understand, mixture of it could be electronics, home goods, kitchenware, toys, pets who knows what dog food who knows what you know what i'm saying so there's a total of nine boxes it's a lot of stuff so it'll be impossible to do this all in one video and keep it under like an hour and a half two hours <laughs> it would be long doing this entire pound one video so it'll be broken up to two parts i'll either do four boxes this video five boxes next video or five this time four next time. it just depends on how quickly i get through the first four if, if it's not too bad on time, I'll go ahead and do five boxes in the first video in part one. So, I'm done rambling. Let's start cracking. Let's see what goodies this hodgepodge has. I know a lot of my viewers who watch me, they love the hodgepodge pouch because you can get some really cool, interesting, fun stuff sometimes. And sometimes some very uh, private stuff. <laughs> scary stuff you can get sometimes but yeah it doesn't look too bad looks like the first box looks like it's mostly like bedroom type of stuff but let's get going first thing too easy we have a blind I'm gonna have to figure out measurements on this thing see if both panels are there but yeah these are so hard to sell as an open package item so incredibly hard I usually just blow both these things out for just like a few dollars usually and next dog jacket okay so we have like a vinyl dog jacket <laughs> for your dog yeah i have to look at things a little bit closer later on look at size how used it is but dog jacket lot, lots of these kinds of items just get donated because it just it's hard to sell some of that stuff. Then we've got the beach is my happy place with a uh, starfish. That's what it's called, starfish, yeah. But his leg is broken off. But this is repairable. I can just glue the leg back on and I will sell this locally for probably, probably uh, like five bucks or so. New though, I guarantee this thing is probably like 10, 15 bucks. But I'll glue the leg back on and uh, sell for like Probably like a quarter of what it actually costs. It's fixable though. Ooh, ooh, no, 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 no. Uh, okay, here we have a jock strap and cup. I went out and reached it and grabbed it. That's the cup. Hear it? So, since it is out of the original packaging, it's been re polybagged by Amazon. Guarantee this is used. Guarantee this is a used jock strap and a cup. So yeah, we're not selling that. I don't even mess with that stuff, that's nasty. Oh, here we have, all this goes around the toilet. Careful, don't actually touch it. Yeah, this goes around the base of the toilet, it wraps around it. So I just, let's just, let's just put that down. I don't mess with toilet stuff. Next we got disposable micro applicators. Let's check this out. 
see what this is about. Oh, it's like little tiny Q-tips. It has to do with makeup, I bet, right? Maybe? I'm not sure. Disposable micro applicators. They're pink. There's a box. There's four of these in the box. They're all still brand new. Let's maybe do like makeup or something. I could be totally off though. It says total 400 pieces in, in this thing. I have no idea on price on that. No clue. J Dog. So looks like we have another dog. Um, probably like vest or jacket or something. I'll have to once again check this thing out closer. And you know, if, if, if stuff's been used like that, I never sell it. It gets donated. You know. Oh, it's a pair of jeans. Doesn't look like used or nasty. What jeans we got? Oh, brand new with tags. We got some Levi 541 Athletic Taper Stretch. Sits at waist, extra room in seat and thigh. 38 by 32. That's nice. That's a brand new pair. Make sure the buttons, yeah, the buttons there. Make sure the buttons there, that's not missing. That's there. Zipper works, not busted. Here's a brand new pair of Levi jeans. 541, 38 by 32s. I'm gonna see how much these cost on Amazon because I have no clue. I know the tags say they're $69.50. That seems a little bit high. But the actual price looks like Amazon. They $39.99 on Amazon for this pair of jeans, 38 by 32. That's actually a really good size. That's a good solid, good selling size. But yeah, 541 athletic taper stretch sits at waist, extra room in seat and thigh. Sells new for 40 bucks. If anybody wants to buy these things, hit me up. First person that hits me up that wants to buy them, $25 shipped anywhere in the US for 25 shipped. You know, I think that's a, I think it's a very fair price. 40 bucks new. These still have the tags on them. 25 shipped. Be quick, because if it's been probably like a day or maybe even a few hours after this 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 has gone live, this will probably already be sold. So be quick on those. Those should sell very fast. Next we've got coconut oil. Really? <laughs> this is why I love hodgepodge, okay? We went from stuff that goes around the toilet to dog stuff, to some kind of applicator, to a brand new pair of Levi's jeans. Now to coconut oil that's used for cooking and baking. That is hodgepodge. Hodgepodge can just go all over the place when it comes to items. They're fun to go through. Oh, it's still a factory seal too. Might wanna to see if my wife wants to keep this actually. Since it's still factory sealed, I mean, if this thing wasn't factory sealed, I would not keep, I would not sell it, but since it's factory still, see if the wife wants to keep it. You never know. Let's see what we got. Um, this looks, oh, look, oh, this is a tablecloth, I see. A gold tablecloth, not very much money. Dinzo. Still new filter. Okay. I don't see a model number on it or anything. Oh, here it is. 143-3005. Look it up. So much thing sells for. So, oh, a replacement flap. Pet safe. I used to get these things a lot in liquidations a few years ago. I got them so often. And it's still brand new, has not been installed yet. Probably 10, 15 bucks for a pet flap. Unless the price of those things have gone crazy, which I highly doubt it. Next we got a coffee maker, Hamilton Beach. This is, oh, this is like a cheaper coffee maker, five cup, eh, you know. I'll sell that thing for probably like 15. Sell it locally. Creative. 
There's a barcode on here. I'm gonna scan the barcode before I open this box up. Because sometimes these boxes have that styrofoam crap in it that just goes everywhere, makes a huge mess. Let's see what this is before. So on the phone it said this is a Creative Co-op Distressed Terracotta Column Pedestal 7 inches cream. This is like a designer decorative piece for somebody's house. See right there on the phone. I'm sure it's focusing, I can't tell. So it sells for like 20 bucks new. So I'll probably take this out of the packaging. As long as it's not broken, sell it for like 10 or 15. Last thing in this box. <laughs> wow. Okay. We have an entire bag of black like gift bags. Wow. Okay. Ooh, I can use these actually. In my shop, whenever I do some of my like $1 grab bag stuff, I can fill these bags up with like some stuff, tape them shut, and $1 grab bags. Yeah, I'm, I'm keeping these. I, I can actually, I can use those bags. So that's it for box number one. Let me box stuff back up. I'll be right back with number two. Here's number two coming up. And there is a little black item hanging out of the side of the box. Like a drawstring for something. So, we're gonna find out what that drawstring goes to. Cause who knows what that might be attached to. This is hodgepodge. It can surprise you. Um, okay. First, the Oregon Trail, the classic computer game. So we got like kind of toys, electronics right here. You know, I said the hodgepodge can have all kinds of different stuff in it. And it can have toys, it can have electronics, it can have clothes, bedding, tools, everything. So here's like a toy electronic. That's kind of neat though. I've never seen this. Had to try it out, see if it works. But yeah, that's different. I think this is brand new with tags. I see a tag on it. Oh, tag came off. Wonderflex Premium Stretch. Looks like maybe some ladies' pants. Size medium. That's the brand. Wonderwink. Okay. Look at the barcode real quick. Check this out. Since the barcode's actually here for it. So these sell new for 20 bucks. So yeah, this might just go into like a donation stack or something. Because without the tags attached, not knowing if they're new or used, you know, I'd be lucky to get 10 bucks out of those. I'd be lucky. Let's see, twin size sheets. Dark gray twin size, Amazon branded bed sheets. I used to sell those things for like $15. And here we've got a peachy pink. Hmm. Might be an article of clothing. Kind of looks like it. So I'll probably just donate it. Here we got a big grill cover. Grill cover for 7107 King Kong Premium. Fits the Genesis 300 series gas grills, which is pretty much the common size for like the most common size shape of grill that there is. So yeah, this is pretty much just becoming grilling season here. So this should sell easily for probably about 25, 30 bucks. Very easily. Oh, here we have a, looks like a padded sports bra. Yeah, yeah, just donate. Kids Lane, sing along Bluetooth karaoke mic. It's a little, little kid's toy, a few bucks. Let's see. Oh, it's a coffee cup. It's not taped shut, it's just like not coming off. So we got like an American page, oh, it's broken. It's broken actually pretty bad. So yeah, it's, it's not sellable. 
That'll end up cutting the person's lip up. So yeah, it's not sellable. It's not even donatable because it could be a safety thing. Here you got a filter. It looks used. Yeah, it is used. There's lots of gunk in it. So yeah, it's probably trash. Wow, this thing is very, very used. Looks like maybe a dog got a hold of it too. It's all chewed, it's all chewed up. So it's, it's just kind of, wow. The bottom of it's all chewed up and mangled. Yeah, I think a dog got a hold of this. It's actually a KitchenAid brand too. It's a good brand. But yeah, a dog got it. <laughs> and so the people returned it. Even though it was their dog that Maybe the neighbor's dog did it. I don't know. But yeah, that'll be... I don't know. That'll be a donator trash. You got like little, little like a uh, baby jar things. Sells things about 50 cents a piece. Probably like five bucks a whole bag. Oh, we got underwear. Let's just keep that in the package. Yeah, good idea. And we've got simple D green cleaner sanitizer... Deodorizer. This is a cleaner stuff. Huh, okay. Simple D green. Yeah, bottle is kind of heavy, so it's probably still full. And last thing, box number two. We've got a sleeping bag. Coleman. Glow in the dark sleeping bag, youth up to five feet. Got the barcode. A lot of times with these sleeping bags, you know, they're just used one time on like a camping trip or sleepover and then they get returned because sometimes people like to use Amazon.com as, as like a rental service. It sells new for 25. So I sell things for like $15 in this condition. But yeah, like that's kind of bad for Amazon.com is not not honestly not it's not very often but it happens more than what it should they're just used as like a rental service for people that want to you know rent a sleeping bag for one night or a weekend trip you know rent a grill cover for a few months for some reason you know you know what i'm saying it happens but anyway box this up here i'm back with the third box number three so box two wasn't the best box. Had a lot of stuff that would be donated in it. Some stuff that would just be trash. So yeah, box box two was kind of a downer. That wasn't a very good box. Not good at all. One piece of paper in this one. So let's see if this one gets any better. So this has like little, these like Dixie cups. So a thing of Dixie cups. A few bucks on that. That's kind of nice. At least this has the package. Like I know what kind of size this is and everything. Five piece set, 56 inch by 84 inch, two panels, two tie backs, and a one of Alice. That's kind of nice. That's I probably saw a thing for like 20 bucks or so. Huh. Then we have a new, like a water filter, a Brita, but it's used, no filter. That's kind of. Yeah. Ah, uh, another jock strap and cup. At least it has the packaging though. That's 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 a positive. Youth large with packaging. Like this I sell locally for honestly just a matter of dollars and let the people take the chance if it's used or new. I'm not gonna touch it. That's nasty. Okay, here we have an iPhone. This is probably gonna be an XS or a 10S case. Looks about that size. It's kind of turned to a color of green though. Has a greenish tint to it. Yeah, yeah, it is. This is the 10s case because the OtterBox Pure Clear cases for the 10s, they're having an issue. Like, as you use them, like for the first week, they start turning like a yellowish color. This one kind of started turning green, so this got returned because of that. We got a Robin Hood Halloween costume for the children. Halloween time, 10, 15 bucks on that. Here in just a few months will be Halloween time before we know it. And I've got a stockpile of costumes from the past several months that I'm holding back for Halloween time. Uh, 
Look at this stuff, some kind of like a tabletop or something. I'm not honestly 100% sure. Some kind of a legs with tabletop, but there's no tabletop on it. Kind of a mystery. What is it, a voodoo doll or something? There's all kind of hair stuck to the inside of the bag and sticking out of the bag. I think it's like, it might be something like a voodoo doll or something. If you look at it, it's kind of what it looks like. Kind of. Uh, what's this? Oh, it's a shower curtain. A used shower curtain. Oof. Another donation item, more than likely. So we got a heater. As long as it works. About 15 on the heater. Here's another one of these different case. But yeah, phone case. Oh, that stinks. Here's a Contigo bottle. Oh, but there is no lid to it. And I don't see the lid in the box either. Missing the lid. Contigo. Okay. Box two and box three are not going very well. Here's a six-piece candle set that says happy birthday on it. Six-piece candle set. A few bucks on that. Where's the good stuff? Where's the expensive stuff? Come on. Filtration. A Frank replacement filter cartridge. I have to look the thing up, see what it sells for. Model number FRX02. Oh. Replacement caster wheels for your computer chair. Yeah, these, these don't sell for very much. I usually try to get about five bucks out of these. And if I get five bucks, I'm happy with it. iPhone cord iPhone cord, chair tips, yeah, a few bucks, we got a hat, okay, okay, best thing on the past two, two boxes probably, we have a Michigan hat, has the tags on it still, has the display thing for it on the shelf, tags on the inside, that's nice. That's probably good, about 15, 20 bucks I can sell that thing for. Let's see, portable electric heater. Looks like, has no brand, it's just like off-brand electric heater. 10 bucks on that. Last thing, box three. Uh, Kasori original double wall electric kettle. That's not bad. Depending on if it's new or used, we'll determine price. Maybe. Come on. Well, this thing is taped to beyond belief. Probably 15, 20 bucks on that. So anyway, that's it for box number three. <clears throat> Last two boxes have been kind of not very good, but it is a nine box palette. So out of the nine boxes, there's gonna be a couple boxes that are just kind of not that great. And I think we got two of them so far so we've got at least one more box we'll see where we're at time wise and figure out if we'll do five or not in this one right back here we go last one maybe box number four hopefully at least this box gets a little bit better than the last two boxes We have a bit of wood. Then we have third brake light, Vera or Silverado GMC Sierra. Third brake light. Appears to be good. Third brake light. Not sure it has much value to it though. But GMC Silverado third brake light. So we got our first automotive item in this hodgepodge palette. A 
Grease X. Mechanics laundry to oh it's leaking too. Hey oh, no. And it's leaking. It's bagged and it's still leaking. Yeah. So next. Oxygen strap included. Predator. Game changer. Breathes, flows, protects, fit, performs. So this goes on to some kind of a like paintball or airsoft breathing system. A breathing piece. I've never seen that. Okay, bring on the hodgepodge. Soap on demand. So it's missing the entire brush. It's not there. But this looks like fun. We have a Make It Rain Money Maker. That looks like fun. Make it rain. Does it come with fake money? No. Says it contains fake $100 bills. But I think the bills are missing. And it might need batteries. So you put the money on top, squeeze the trigger, and then you make it rain. Okay. I'm sure it has a little bit of value to it. Probably not a whole lot. It's more kind of gimmicky, but it's fun, I bet. But you need some fake fake money or put a bunch of ones in it or something. Clinique for win for men. Oil control face wash. A whole bag of it. There's a total of five in here. Clinique for men. Face wash. That's neat. Probably a couple bucks a bottle, maybe. Whole thing for like eight, ten dollars. That could be extremely high though. We got another pair of Levi's. That's cool. We got 513 Slim Straight Stretch Sits Below Waist. This one's also brand new with tags on this one. Let's see, do I have a barcode to scan? So much these things cost. We'll give a deal on this pair too. That's kind of nice. So we've got Levi's, kind of like a dark, a dark wash to them. Has the button. Zipper works. Those are nice. Let's scan this barcode. See, see what kind of price we're looking at. These are $49.99 on Amazon. Pretty good price jeans. 50 bucks for these jeans. 38, 30, 36, 32, 513, slim straight stretch. You know what? I'm in a I'm in a good mood today. First person wants these things, $30 shipped, hit me up. I'm knocking $20 off of the price. They're, they're, they're brand new with tag still. Hit me up, 30 bucks. First person, they are yours. Let's see, what is this? Oh, Naturonics, Nature's Care For You Beer Grooming Kit. It's still factory sealed, but the top is kind of damaged. Might have to crack this thing open up to see what kind of beard grooming kit is in this thing. I might be able to use some of that stuff. Ah, underwear. What's this? Contigo coffee cup. Sounds like there's a little bit of liquid inside of it still. So, yeah. Oh, here's some more. Levi's. That's nice. Are these tags? Yes, these also are new with tags. These are 36 by 32, 541 athletic taper stretch. The last ones were, what were those? 513, these are 541. See, button works, zipper works. It's also kind of dark wash, 5441 athletic taper jeans. 
Scan the barcode, see how much these bad boys sell for. Okay, these are $39.99 on Amazon. Not, not a bad price. So first person wants these things, hit me up. $25 shipped. I'm knocking $15 off the price for this pair if you want these. These are the 541 Athletic Taper Stretch. 36 by 32. 25 shipped in the US. They're yours. AVAX water bottle. Probably used. Wired transformer cable. And the pack the packaging is kind of opened up on it. Yeah. What is this? Darice? Some kind of like a stand for something. I don't know. That's keep there's two of them in here. A gold stand for something. Here's a Stanley coffee cup. Or soup or whatever you want to keep warm in there. Had to see if the things never used. Maybe like 10 bucks or so. If it's not like nasty. There's a thing, griddle toolkit, five piece professional grade. Griddle kit. That's neat. Probably good 15, 20 bucks on that, I bet. Then we've got Ultra Pro Surge Protection. 15 feet. That's a fancy one. It has six outlets to it, plus two USB outlets for it. So a total of actually no seven. It's a total of nine. Nine on here. So that's awesome. I'll probably end up keeping this this one because I can always use more of those around the house just for you know stuff. Keeping this 20 vacuum seal. Actually, no, these are sealer bags. I actually don't need this. If these are like Ziploc bags, I keep them like or like the Ziploc. Normally, these are like sealer bags, so I'll be selling these things for probably like five, six, eight dollars or so. Couple things left. We have the top of it kind of like goes on something. It's like a metal metal bowl thing. It kind of goes in like a a steak or something. Different. The last thing. Full and queen, one duvet cover, two standard shams. So like a bedding set, 20 bucks on that. So it wasn't too bad. Uh, Time-wise, without editing this video right now, I'm saying I'm at about 36 minutes. That's without any kind of editing at this point. So I think I'm just going to stop right here on this one because this hasn't been the best first four boxes. So yeah. Let me, just, <laughs> let me just stop on these first four. Hopefully those last five are like fantastic boxes. But we did get out three pairs of Levi jeans out of the first four boxes, and they were all brand new. So that was nice. But this was full of a lot of, oof, kind of, kind of trash. And a lot of stuff I'm going to end up donating and stuff I'll sell for literally dollars. So the first four, I was not too impressed with the first four boxes on this palette. Well, there's five more to go still. <clears throat> this is a $3,000 palette. So with that kind of price point, there's got to be some higher end items hiding in those last five boxes. There has to be. So stay tuned. We'll see part soon. Coming up very soon. Thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you next time. I'm out. <laughs>